and wheat at the bottom, two sugar, and there we go. Cake for everybody! Happy birthday! Om nom nom nom. Hello everybody and welcome. I'm done with redstone projects for a while now, but my minecart track is not usable yet. So I'm going to change that. I'll build a station here in the village. And let's see, my track is down there, going straight through the well. So I want it to go on straight under here. And then turn here and start climbing up. Yeah, somewhere here the track should come up and then around here I suppose I want to have the station building. I think I'm going to keep the basic village design here. So like those houses there, a layer of cobblestone first for the walls. And what size do I want it? This looks right, doesn't have to be huge. And then the corners I'll make from wood. And in between that, planks. I'll want to have glass panes in there too though. Now this is an even number of blocks deep, so I can't really put any blocks in the middle. But it is an odd number of blocks wide. The minecarts will come in here, but I don't want villagers on my tracks when I get them back. So I'm going to divide this. On this half I'll have planks on the floor. It's like a platform where villagers can walk. And on the other half I'll have cobblestone and I'll have to track on there. So the minecarts will come in here. Well, that's starting to look like a building, but what to do for the roof? Let's see how cobblestone slabs look. And once this is done, and I'll have the tracks placed as well, then at least I have a functioning minecart ride from the farm to the village and back. Cow, what do you think you're doing up here? Silly animal. Anyway, then I'll worry about other destinations later. I want to have a track going to my compass rows in the desert. And I want to have tracks going to my jungles and abandoned mine. Now I do have another abandoned mine project somewhere else. And if you remember, I go there by boat. I built a lighthouse near the entrance. 
I want to keep that like that. I'm not going to build tracks to there. I like the idea of having to use different transportation methods to get to different places. Speaking of transportation methods, I also have some paths near my farm made out of cobblestone. They're not really going anywhere. One is from the farm to the small lake where I built my first dirt shelter. And the other one goes to a bridge over the ravine and ends there, close to the desert. My original plan was to extend that to the desert and add a path to the village. But I never really made any efforts to build that. It takes some planning and is slow to build, since I don't just make them go straight and have sharp turns. But if I do expand that network, I can use it as roads for rideable pigs. Anyway, that will be a project in the future, so don't expect to see that too soon. Now, I have a roof on this station, let's see how that looks. Put some planks in there. And let's do that on the other side as well. Yeah, that looks pretty good, I think. Just need to replace these slabs with full blocks. The chicken, uh, get out of the way. It's good, but maybe I can break up that wall a bit with wood beams. Yeah, that's better. Fits well in the village, if I say so myself. It's not a traditional looking station like people often make from bricks. But that's fine, I don't see why they should look like that. And I'll have glass panes as windows, also like the rest of the village structures. But it's not a station without a name sign. I do need to think of a proper name though. Hmm, that's looking a bit empty. Let's see how a wooden beam looks there. Come on, place that block. Yeah. Now to add a door, I might need to repopulate this village with zombie villagers. But then I'd need a splash potion, and so I'd need a brewing stand, and so... Anyway, let's add a fence here so any future villagers can go in the station without getting on the tracks. Well, let's see how that track is doing. Don't worry, I'm not going to get in the redstone area. Just through here. Oh no, no! No, 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 my tracks! Ah, uh, well, luckily that water can't get to any redstone. Let's block this off now. So I can rebuild the track. Well, that's not the most complicated part anyway.
And that still works. So now to take care of this. That's better. Well, I suppose I don't need that one layer there either. This should be safe now. So the track just goes straight down here. And I dug a hole where the turn has to come. But I haven't found that. Maybe I didn't dig it deep enough. So let's see where I am now. That looks like night out there. Oh yeah, I need to go a bit further still. Let's just keep this clear of monsters. Oh, hello spider. Oh, 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 this is not good. Oh, why didn't I have a sword ready? That could have been worse. Anyway, now I know I'm not far off. Let's just dig some more. Oh, there we are. So now I'm off in this direction. Ooh, now what's that? Well, uh, it's a cave. And I didn't have my sword ready again. Luckily, these zombies move so slow now. Anything else down there? Nope, and nothing here. Down here then, maybe? No, that is all. Oh yeah, now let's switch back to the pickaxe. And I should start getting up. I hope I have enough room to get up. I didn't really plan this out. Well, I could still go back a few blocks. Oh no, that looks about right. Yeah, that's perfect. Couldn't have been better. And I'll have to build some fence around here too. Ah. 
Let's fix this path. Yeah, so that's the station done. Now I just need to add the track here. And then once that's in place, I'd be able to take the minecart down in here, round the corner, straight through the well, and then all the way back to my farm. So I'm just going to pick up some supplies there now. Some track, and I may need to craft some more. Well, that should be enough. And I just didn't make it. Well, let's widen this tunnel and add in some power tracks. Maybe then I do have enough tracks. And no more pickaxe. Well, nearly there on this side. Yeah, that's the well. So now let's do this side. And then I can add the power tracks. I need a good amount of them on the slope. I could test it out and use just the exact amount of power tracks needed. Or I could just throw them in there and if that works, then it works. Well, now I'm out of power tracks anyway. But it looks like I can finish the track now. And add a button. Ooh, you only need one stone now to craft a button. Well, that's certainly an improvement. And I'll build a hatch here for maintenance access. I have a tunnel going all under the track where I put upside down levers to power the powered tracks. Oh, but it's night. Not a good time to be out here. And one found his way in. So anyway... And another lever there. Mm. 
now to close off that area where the track comes out of the ground. And let's put some light on that. And one in the middle here. Here too. And this side doesn't really have a middle, so... Uh, well, maybe here. So that's the village station all done and connected to the main track system, even though that only leads to the farm now. But yeah, let's go for a ride. Get in the cart over the fence. Junction coming up here. Oh, that's not supposed to happen. Well, I'll have to fix that some other time, because that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you again next time.